Play of City family, what is up? It is Bobby and I have just parked my car here in the Target parking lot, about to go into Target and see what is new, what's exciting, maybe some holiday themed items. You never know what happens when you step inside the front door of Target. So let's get in there and do what we always do, show you what to buy, what to avoid, and how to read the ingredients so you put the best quality stuff in your body. Uh, before we get in there and do the thing we always do, like, subscribe, share, spread that Flav City love. But I also want you to check out thrivemarket.com using my promo link down below. Thrive is a six year supporter of the channel and the reason why I like them is pretty much anything you would get at any grocery store is on Thrive Market, but it's cheaper. You save about $32 per order and the box comes to your door. You don't even have to go to the store if you don't want to. More importantly, right now, uh, Flav City fans are getting the hookup. When you click my link in the description box, you get 25% off your first order, a free gift, one of those free gifts is two cartons of Kettle and Fire bone broth, and it's 30 days risk-free. So check it out using my link down below. Less talking, more shopping. Let's go into Target. I spy something new in the cereal aisle, and it, it's certainly not this. I used to eat these way back in the day as a dessert. The Reese's Peanut Butter Puffs uh, cereal here. Oh my God, that is a gargantuan bag and a gargantuan list of ingredients there with artificial flavor. It did taste good back in the day, but that's definitely a no-no now that I'm woke, right? Uh, but here we go. I've never seen this one here. This is one of the best Bobby approved cereals on the market. Seven Sundays Paleo Grain-Free Cereal. You maybe have seen me talk about it before at Whole Foods, but look at this. This is their real cacao flavor. Boom, it's not cassava starch, it's whole cassava flour, which is nutrient dense. Sunflower protein, dates as the sweetener, coconut sugar as a sweetener, coconut oil and real vanilla. There's only two grams of added sugar per serving. It's not low carb. $5.99 is a touch pricey, but if you eat cereal, something we just don't eat at home because it's still processed and not nutrient dense like um, pasture raised eggs and keto toast and stuff that I'd rather eat, but this is one of the best on the market. You can compare it to almost any other one. Even like if you look at whole grain organic stuff, they always have bad oils and sugars. This is good. I've talked about it before. There's one called Lovebird that is good. Uh, Ezekiel makes a sprouted green organic one. And once again, the Thrive Market Coconut Nut cereal is one of the only ones we have at home. I use that as a snack or sometimes as a dessert. It's coconut meat and coconut water with a touch of starch. It's keto paleo. It tastes like crispy coconut flakes. It's unbelievable. So when you try Thrive Market using my promo link down below, try that cereal. You will go bananas for it. And if you're at Target, this one is really good. And so is the uh, cinnamon one. The Siete selection is expanding here at Target, and that's a good thing because they now have the sweet churro chips along with the savory ones they've had for a while. But these are paleo refined sugar-free churro strips. The ingredients on this are totally crazy. Look at this. So it's cassava flour based, cooked in avocado oil, sweetened with coconut sugar and agave. I'm not thrilled about agave per se because it has uh, the same amount of fructose as cane sugar, but still, it's not that bad. There's pumpkin powder, cinnamon, real vanilla powder. Ingredients are great. So five grams of sugar per, how many chips? 14 chips, I can deal with that. These are good. The price is $4.99, so not too bad. That being said, it is the holiday season now and they should be coming out with their limited edition of Bunuelos, which is like this, same ingredients, but I think even better. In the meantime, this is great to see, but if you see Bunuelos on the shelf anywhere you are, get them for sure. All right, everyone say hi to Kiana. Hi. She was walking by and she goes, is that you on the cookbook there? I said, yeah, that's me. Uh, and she's going to check it out. So good luck on your keto journey, Kiana. Thank you. <laughs> And if you happen to find yourself in a Target, I'm very happy to say that every Target in the country now has our first best-selling cookbook, Keto Meal Prep in the paperback edition. Here's the price, and they ordered it for every single store. And if you come to this store here in Pompano, there's only, or the Deerfield Beach actually, there's only one copy left. I signed it for y'all, but every Target I go to, I will sign that. So check out your local Target. It's in every single one in the country, which is kind of cool. And if you want to start a keto journey like Kiana, that's the cookbook you need. There's also a lot of free recipes on YouTube, so check it out. 
let's meander into the personal care section. Sometimes on the Flav City Instagram, I show my uh, skincare routine and stuff like that. And people get a kick out of that because they're like, oh, that's interesting. And they're like, oh, you're very high maintenance, Bobby. And yes, I am very high maintenance. I'm 43 years old and I want to take care of my skin so I look good and I feel good. That being said, the stuff behind me right here is like your traditional face cleansers. And a lot of people scan either this or that with the Bobby approved app. By the way, it works for non-food items too. And it's not approved because if you look at the ingredients on any personal care thing, and if you see pegs like peg 40, if you th see things like polysorbate 20 or polysorbate 80, usually things that have dash numbers like that and something called phenoxyethanol, these are harsh chemicals. Some are called parabens or pegs. You don't want that on your skin. Uh, they don't have anything here, but the one I use at home is from Pure Haven. It's a little expensive, but not that bad. Like a bottle is like $25 and it lasts a while. It's a really, really high quality. They do behind me though, have a good cocoa kind. Cocoa kind is really good and clean. And so is a cure. I actually use this one right here, the rose water toner. After I shave, I spray that to soothe my pores. And then Desi and I use this daily SPF, very good stuff. And a cure, pretty much anything a cure makes is very good. I also use um, their shampoo and conditioner and another brand called Wellness. Very good and very good. These are the best you can do at Target. It's just kind of funny that in the cleanser section, they put the Vital Proteins Collagen. So yeah, there's a loose connection between collagen and skin. It's just really funny that it's in the personal care section, but the price, ooh, that jug is way more expensive here than like a warehouse like Costco. This is such a bummer. I just ran out of my propolis throat spray and Target is supposed to have that nationwide, but I haven't seen it. You guys see me spray it all the time. It's the um, propolis throat spray, which is perfect for this time of year. Propolis is the active ingredient in uh, honey. Very immune boosting, but when you talk a lot like me, or if you get a tickle in your throat, you spray this, it's fantastic. So I'll just order some actually on Thrive Market. They have it for probably just a bit cheaper than here. And with my promo code, the link down below, you get 25 off on top of that. I swear by that stuff. It just makes the throat feel so good and helps kick a bug out there. So order that on Thrive, or if you see it at your local target, the Beekeepers Propolis, I would scoop it for sure. It seems like every news channel is talking about the supply chain shortage lately. And look at this. You come to the beef section of Target here, it's extremely low and they essentially have no grass-fed beef. All they have is this one, and the price has gone up. This is crazy, you guys. I think the supply chain is gonna get even worse for the remaining part of the holiday season, and it's gonna carry over well into next year. I mean, we're trying to line up products for Shop Flav City for next year, and it's very hard to get stuff. Man, oh man, crazy stuff going on. A few people asked me to review the new Vital Proteins performance bars at uh, Target here. They're collagen bars with protein. This is uh, chocolate almond. This is salty chocolate peanut. I'm a peanut butter fan, so I'm gonna check this one out here. And it has the grass-fed pasture-raised collagen, which is nice, but if you go after the collagen, they're using milk protein isolate and whey protein. That's not grass-fed and that's not pasture-raised, so that's gonna be from GMO whey, unfortunately. And then if you keep reading here, you'll see that there's peanut oil down there sunflower oil right there and the dreaded natural flavor so just because the collagen is good doesn't mean everything is good from them and many of their flavor stuff has natural flavor so unfortunately i'm gonna go where no for that bar all right family that is it from target i'm in the christmas section i have a feeling in just a couple of weeks the christmas is going to explode all over the store and i'm 100 percent okay with that uh, but that is it i'm going to make some more holiday theme hauls all around the grocery stores make sure to check out thrive market using my promo link down below get your 25 percent off your first order your free gift and it's 30 days risk free you will love it uh, but from tarjay i leave you like i always do hashtag keep on cooking mad love and peace later